Shouldn't see me. Shouldn't hear me. It's a clean kill. And none of it is going to go to waste. What's your name, Ranger? Italian. What were you? A lieutenant? No, actually, I was a captain. Oh, my mistake! We have a captain in our midst! Well, better look sharp, eh? Captain's coming. Better sharpen the swords, eh? And make sure our boots are nice and shiny. <laughs> oh, so tell me, Captain, have you ever hunted a growl? That Graug has what you promised me. Aye. Not just any Graug. The largest one I ever came across. <sighs> we must prepare! I should do just fine. I've been trained very well. My dog, Silver was trained very well. That was before she got eaten by a warg. Hunt! It's not about rules, my captain. We're not going to line up and have someone play with our lives. It's about instinct, and it's about guts. Which, as you can see, I know a thing or two about. <laughs> you want basics on the hunt. Follow me. The hunt is its own beast, one you must learn to tame. First lesson of Karagor hunting, do not die. What do we need them for? We ride them. A worthy mount for a dangerous hunt. Now these beasts will not be impressed by your rank. All flesh tastes the same to them. Once you go on the hunt, Captain, you'll come out a changed man. Hopefully for the better, but you never know. When I was hunting wargs, I picked up their ways quickly. But Caragors, well, those bastards are a tougher breed. Took me nearly a year to figure them out. Caragors. The buggers hate water. I once tried to ride one through a river, and she hightailed it up a cliffside with me on its back. Amazing what they'll do to avoid a good cleaning, eh? The hunt is my mistress. Beautiful, thrilling, infectious. And she doesn't nag, like my wife. Oh, you haven't lived until you've been on the hunt, Captain. The very air smells different. Like triumph. Ranger, over here! That one over there looks quite aggressive. Don't even try creeping up on a Karagor. It'll catch your scent a mile away. What do you propose, then? Why don't you hop in and introduce yourself? Ask it for a ride. charges, you have two options. Knock the bastard down, or eat dirt. You're not gonna mount a Karagor on your first try. Took a few scars to perfect my method. What now? Climb on its back! Hold tight! I can't walk with the beast! about the same time it took me to tame one. You might be a natural, Captain. You didn't fare too bad back there. Where'd you get your training, Captain? I hail from the Black Gate. The Black Gate. Nice place. Sounds depressing. <laughs> Let's 
find some Uruks. Now that you tame the beast, let's see if it'll fight for you. Old Chief's had a secret meeting. Whoa, hunting orcs! Great way to unwind! But I can take out more than you, Ranger! You've been hunting and learning for long, Dwarf. For years and years. Land used to be more lush. Now a doom slowly sweeps over it. Like much of Mordor. Yes. Though the doom does add a space to the hunt. Sure you can ride a car, but can you shoot from one? Young, the mountains green, no stay at on the moon was seen. No words were made, no stream or stone. When Joe and the moon come off the moon, that was brilliant. Double points. Seems I lost track. Lucky you. Another cap. Put you to a final test. Fight him however you like. Oh, running short on lessons? Running long on lip? You'll need to think on your feet. When we face the Grog, can't always look to me for help. The hunt is about discipline. Training yourself to see the perfect moment, rather than being told it. I once tracked a great eagle back to her nest. I decided to let them be, even before they tossed me to the rocks below. <laughs> More hunting party! Let's hunt them bastards for a change! Time for blood! <laughs> Too quiet. Something must be wrong. Go to him, Talion. Perhaps we should track the hunter. You'll make a nice meal, dwarf! Torven needs help. Just so you know, I had him. What does riding Karagors have to do with killing Graugs? All these questions, Captain. Well, you were supposed to follow orders. You are testing my patience, Torvin. Pay attention. Learn to respect the beast. You're gonna need size and strength to fight the mighty Graug. Remember, on the hunt, 
expect to sir. Oh, who knows? He'll even call you sir, eh? <laughs> <laughs> This dwarf is far from home. Not all those who wander are lost. You're not put off by my wee scars. Oh, not at all. I actually have a few of my own. <laughs> oh, I'll bet. What type of battle scars did you get from the Black Gate, eh? Splinters! <laughs> oh, or did you uh, scar your voice telling your soldiers to head into battle? Tread lightly. My scars run very deep. Huh. The mighty Grog, he gave me these, and he also took my hunting partner. So what now? Well, another lesson for you, my captain. <clears throat> Maybe you'll even come out of this one on Scar. <laughs> So, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Crobane to prepare us for the mighty Grog? You want to hunt Grog? Then so you shall. But not just any Grog. This is a rare one. It's territorial. Strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain, you ever slay a Grog before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Grog? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Graugs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Graugs heel for nothing! You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes! There it goes! What a fine, fine specimen! And it'll meet a fine end. to pierce its ankle if I want to bleed it. to ride.
I need a category for speed. Unusual to ride a ground. Nothing like a little improvising, eh? <laughs> All right, Captain. That's it. You showed instinct, gumption, respect. <laughs> Training's over. Got guts. Let's go spill some, eh? The darkness of Mordor doesn't seem to touch that dwarf. The Seven Rings of Power did not turn the Dwarf Kings to wraiths, as the Nine Rings did to man. They are a stubborn stone and cannot be dominated by evil. That is why Sauron has sworn to destroy them.
I dare that ranger to jump down on me from up high. Keeping my eyes peeled. I'll call out if you see him. I'll fill him full of arrows so he'll be dead. <laughs> Ha! <laughs> 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 